Two years before it became a movie, the best-selling novel Auntie Mame was adapted for the stage. The team of Betty Comden and Adolph Green were assigned the task of turning the play into a screenplay. Comden and Green were best known for writing musicals, but with Auntie Mame, they wrote a straight comedy. Ironically, eight years after their adaptation's release, a musical comedy version opened on Broadway called Simply Mame, starring Angela Lansbury. That Broadway musical led to another screen adaptation in 1974, a musical this time, starring Lucille Ball. Up next, we'll continue our 31 Days of Oscar Marathon of Best Picture nominees with the five films that earned that honor for 1949, kicking things off with a movie that won Olivia de Havilland the Oscar for Best Actress. Tonight on TCM's 31 Days of Oscar, we enjoy a wealth of 1949 Best Picture nominees. First with Olivia de Havilland as The Heiress. Then Broderick Crawford campaigns in the year's win, All the King's Men. And Gregory Peck takes command of a squadron in the sky with 12 o'clock high. If you're a fan of classic films and love collecting,